This is lesson 153, Geometry Review. So remember these. A parallelogram has parallel opposite sides. A rhombus is a parallelogram with four equal sides. A rectangle is a parallelogram with four right angles. A square is a rectangle, but with four equal sides. A trapezoid has only two parallel sides. After you watch this video and complete the worksheet, and greens are optional, when you're done all the worksheets, you will use the answers to these worksheets to complete the quiz in your math assignment in classwork. So let's look at this. Let's do this class practice and matching. Okay, did you get them all right? All right, now identify these. And this is what you should have gotten. You can use yesterday's math to help you. Solve and check these equations. And this is what you should have gotten for number four. N equals three and X equals 18. And check, don't forget your steps. Write the temperatures. Remember each segment is two degrees, so this is what you should have gotten. Fahrenheit, Celsius, Celsius, Fahrenheit. Solve these story problems. The bookstore at Victory Christian School sold 14 boxes of pencils that contained 96 pencils in each box. Each pencil sold for 12 cents. How much did all the pencils cost? So there are a couple ways you could have solved this, but basically you had to multiply all the numbers together. So I did 96 times 12 cents to find out how much was the cost of one box. And then I multiplied that answer times 14 to see how much it was for 14 boxes. And I got $161.28. I hope you got that too. Mrs. Razna bought 36 oranges for $15.84. At that rate, what would one orange cost? So if 36 oranges are $15.84, to find the cost of one orange, I have to divide $15.84 by 36. Remember when you divide, bring your decimal point straight up, and I got 44 cents for one orange. Divide and check. And this is what you should have gotten. I crossed off all the greens to follow the signs, matching, and fill in the blanks. Okay, so this is what you should have gotten. Remember for C and D, you had to find common denominators first. This one was subtract. And then these conversions, seven days in a week, Four times seven is 28. Four quarts in a gallon. Three times four is 12. Kilo is a thousand. Milli is a one thousandth. Hecto is a hundred. Deci is a tenth. One tenth. Centi is one hundredth. And Deca is ten.